notebook therapy unboxing. I've been using notebook therapy for a few years now and I'm not sponsored by them, but notebook therapy, if you're somehow seeing this, I would love to be. Anyways, um, my favorite thing about notebook therapy notebooks is how durable their pages are. They are able to withstand a lot of different mediums because I tend to like to use markers, even sometimes watercolors, and the pages don't seem to like rub through or bleed through. The first journal that I'm unboxing is actually my favorite one. It's the Tsuki Dream Sailing Journal, and it has a navy fabric hardcover with holographic designs along the front and the sides. It even has along the pages a cute flower design going down. I don't know why that brings me so much joy. It, it just does. <laughs> Both of the notebooks that I purchased were A5 bullet journals, meaning they have a dot grid pattern on the inside instead of the normal line sheets. These ones also do have 176 pages in them, but I know depending on the journal that you're choosing, they have a few different sizes. Like I know there's a B5 and then they also have a different range for how many pages the notebook itself has. Every notebook also comes with a cute little paperclip that is shaped to fit the theme, like this one has a little sailboat paperclip. This next journal that I'm unboxing is called the Tsuki Moonlit Spell Journal, and like the other one, it has a fabric hardcover, holographic designs along the front, back, along the pages, all that. But that is where the similarities end, my friend, because this journal, I've never had a journal like this one before. Essentially, from the outside, they look like they're pretty much gonna be the same journal, but on the inside of this one, it has blacked out pages. While this one has blacked out pages, it is still a bullet journal, so it has that dot grid pattern on the inside. I believe when I was selecting this journal, though, it gave me the option to have dot grid or blank pages. Unfortunately, as of posting this video, this specific design is sold out. However, they do have a bunch of other designs that have the blacked out pages available, as well as some with brown tone pages. I believe that the first notebook that I opened up in this video is currently still in stock. If you made it to the end of the video, leave a comment letting me know which notebook you would choose. And while you're there, might as well drop a like, subscribe, and maybe even hit that little notification bell. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!